today I've got an unboxing video to share with everybody. I was really lucky to be selected to be part of the Artful Days goodie box design team and the first box that I'm going to be working with is the September goodie box um, and the theme for that is Tweet Tweet um, and you're going to watch me unbox the box. I have no idea what's going to be in here other than I know it's going to have something to do with birds and trees and things like that. Um, we'll wait and see. Um, it comes signed for in the post, um, wrapped up in brown paper, nicely securely packaged. I took the brown paper off and inside we've got this really pretty ribbon and tissue paper which I'm sure most of you will also hoard and add to your stash because it's going to be really useful. So let's have a look what's inside. So we'll just move that over to one side and see if we can get in Without destroying the tissue paper too much. I really have no idea. This is my first box from this company and I'm really excited to see what I've got. Um, I'm going to be making a couple of projects, two or three projects this month and sharing those with you on my blog. Um, the link to that's down below in the description. Um, let's see what we're going to get in the box. Here we go. All right, there's a list. There's 18 different things in here. Um, little checklist. And this is a thank you gift. Let's have a look what's in here. Oh, wow, look at that. That's really cute. Some uh, little pink crystals, embellishments in a bottle, which is going to be really nice. Organza bag, everybody likes those. And more tissue paper. You know, I've had several different goodie boxes from uh, different companies and the packaging really makes all the difference. I think we all like the unboxing as much as uh, what's inside. Oh wow, so we have, what is this? Birds nesting, okay, so this is like, like a fibrous, like a sizely uh, natural fiber. That's really nice for some texture on some mixed media work. I really like the look of that. And we've got some beautiful flowers. I have seen previous boxes from this company and there's always some beautiful flowers in there. Um, they look like they're fabric. Really nice stamens in the middle there. So that's a good bunch with one, two, three. Looks like six flowers in there. Very good. Um, oh, some really nice uh, mulberry paper flowers. Good selection of shapes and sizes, it's really nice detail, lovely colours, like those. And oh, these are cute. Some resin embellishments, little birds on nests. So, really nice detail. They're flat backed, so it'll be easy to stick onto something. And what have we got here? Oh, that's like the Mockingbird Hunger Games uh, Mockingbird charms there. Pack of two of those brass charms. Again, really just right up my street for mixed media work. Those will definitely uh, be used this month. And we have some more. Embellish some more resin embellishments. A set of three bird cages. They're really the detail on those is absolutely fantastic, and they'll look really nice with some colour added, either gilding waxes or alcohol inks, maybe um, even acrylic paints. They're really lovely. A set of three of those. Oh, I can see some bling here. Wow, look at, look at, look, can we see those? 
a bit of glare off the packaging there but those those are fabulous really nice I like those and wow it's a beautiful peacock charm um, it's got like a verdigris finish on it and the tail looks to be articulated that's very nice that's unusual I've not seen that one before and some more resin embellishments some birds uh, beautiful peacock again really nice uh, good size as well those as well I mean the peacock there he's got this with three inches tall that's lovely and our lovely wooden uh, embellishment there he's really cute that's quite quirky and modern I like that very different from the detailed resin ones that that's lovely and some fabric that was unexpected really nice let's have a look and see how big this is okay so that's about eight inches wide about two foot long so that's a really good uh, good size piece of fabric there like a linen effect nice tree print on it no idea how I'm going to use that yet. We'll see. And some metal embellishments next. Gosh, it's quite heavy. That's lovely. Um, that's got a loop on each end, a little branch, and spray of leaves. Very nice. Good quality. You can tell the quality by the weight of it. It's really good. Um, Okay, and I'm going to say this wrong now. This is Scrapinyak, I believe. Um, it is chipboards. Very detailed. Um, beautiful fine oval with a bird cage. That is lovely. Really pretty. Okay, on a set of assorted metal embellishments here. We've got uh, birds, leaves little bird on a swing, an owl there that looks like we could put a gem inside. So that's a really nice assortment uh, of metal embellishments and charms in there. And we've got like a glass cabochon um, with a picture in the back. A vintage picture of a bird in a bird cage. That's really nice. So quite a deep glass cabochon and some wooden bird cages and birds they're really nice so they're like a robin and possibly magpie hard to tell really nice good quality again really useful and what else have we got in here some papers a pack of six by six papers let's have a little look at those These will go really nicely with those flowers that we've got earlier on. And they're really, they're good quality papers. They are, um, there's a good stiffness to them, which is always nice. Very pretty. And last but not least, what have we got in here? Oh, some greyboard sheets that's a pack of two greyboard sheets um, so they'd be really nice substrate for a mixed media panel or um, quite possibly if you want to make a book um, they're really good good solid for a book cover and Last thing in the bottom of the box, 
coming next month, Changing Seasons. That will be the theme for the October box. I say this is currently, uh, this is your September box. Let's just move that out of the way. And let's just see, yeah, we've got, um, we've got our grey board, our six by six papers, that lovely fabric. And we've got um, our wooden embellishments, metal embellishments and cabochon chipboard, more metal embellishments and wooden ones. Then we've got those beautiful resin embellishments, the super sparkly gems, uh, the mockingbird charms, little birds in the nests, that fabulous uh, peacock, Our paper flowers, fabric flowers, and the bird's nest fibre material, and the little extra thank you gift of the, uh, the pink stones. So all in all, you know, that is a great value box for, I believe, £21.99 if you buy it, including the postage in the UK. I will check on that. Um, Obviously, as part of the team, I've been sent this to work with and I look forward to coming back and sharing some projects with you using these project, these um, products and hoping to inspire you to create something um, if you buy your own box. This is just a great value there, really brilliant. The next box is available to pre-order on the 25th of September. Um, there's a newsletter that you can sign up to on the website. And there's a Facebook page and uh, so to keep up to date with what's going on and we'll be sharing our projects on there as well. So I'm really impressed and can't wait to get to, get to work with these products. I hope you've enjoyed them. Thank you very much. Goodbye.